Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. This is Emily Jane. Um, I wanted to show you a few little adjustments I've been making in the van. I've been learning how to live in here for the last two and a half months. And I have decided that things just needed a bit of a reshuffle. Things weren't quite right. Um, so I bought some new storage things. I've shifted around some stuff. Um, and I wanted to show you what that looks like now and what Kevin currently looks like. I feel like it's going to be a continual change, um, this whole van, like living area, um, because I'm going to be changing all the time, I suppose, and, and how I use it in the different seasons will be changing. But um, yeah, a few things that I just needed to alter. Um, so I did. And um, I'm going to just show you them now because it does, it does just feel different in here. Um, so I suppose this is like a updated van tour. So I'll take you around and then show you the different things. So I think the most kind of obvious ones um, regarding storage units are these two additional um, boxes down here. Um, the one on the left hand side, this one over here, is now my new shoe box. And it's, oh my gosh, it's super cute, isn't it? Little hearts on. And I've got some coasters that match and it's a tea towel set that match. So it's perfect and goes with the decor really nicely. Um, but I just found that my shoes were just floating around the van. And I had a shoe box. It was at the back of the van. Because I thought that I would, you know, with shoes, I'd want to take them off, put them out the back and, you know, get it from the back door. But no, all of my shoes just ended up kind of milling around the van, which just, annoyed me so I've moved my shoe box I've downsized it slightly um, to this really cute little uh, heart box from the range I love the range um, and um, yeah and I've used the other storage for something else at the back there which I will show you in a moment and the other box over here this is also super cute it's also from the range um, can you tell I love the range um, I'm not sponsored by them, obviously, but they are a really, like, stinkingly cute shop. I love it. Anyway, um, this is just like a little wicker basket, and I found that my food being up on the top of the shelf was just a massive faff to get down, so I just needed, like, a bit of quick access, and there's so much room in here. So this is, like, my little, little larder, I suppose, and um, obviously it's next to my fridge with all my fresh stuff in there, so that's cool. Um... So yeah, they take up a little bit of floor space, but I don't mind, like, they, I don't notice it. They're they're tucked away against, you know, the the back curtain, so, and they're all really cute, so. But yeah, so those are the kind of main changes, I suppose. So I replaced the old shoe box with um, most of the contents from that big box of, like, games and fun and things, like my sort of outdoorsy stuff, which... Um, I wasn't using as much as, um, well I was using it but you know I can definitely get that from the back of the van a lot easier than I can get shoes from the back of the van. So that's all gone there and then my sort of literal like board games and card games and stuff have gone into this small box over here. And then I've rejigged this storage area a bit so I've got all that massive space in the middle where that big box was before. My sort of toiletry box and bookshelf box have shimmied over to the middle just to make them a little bit more accessible. Um, and then my booze bucket rip the booze bucket um and turned into a cleaning bucket i don't know if that shows i'm becoming an adult or but i drank all the stuff in it and all of the cleaning stuff was in my like toiletry stuff and i was just like there's not enough room in this little wicker basket so i just i just moved it into one box again i really think that this is just going to continue to change as as it needs to um but that that's currently what it looks like so a few other little um decorations have been put up i put up this really nice little bit of ribbon from the um curtain hangers and got some pegs and some pictures and pick uh, picked up um stuck them up i don't know you know what i mean pegged them up that's what i'm thinking of um so that's going across there just filling that little white area i've been thinking about what to do with that for ages and this works because it can be really easily undone I've also got some pictures and cards pegged up to my win not window, mirror. So um, they're cute and I just use yeah, normal pegs as well. I like pegs, they're cute. This was another little thing I bought. It's uh, just a 
it's just a tray with like that padded stuff underneath it um but because i don't really have a table and um, because i often eat my dinner sat on my bed or just sat outside the van it's quite useful to have a little tray and it's super cute with hearts on and really like nice pretty things sorry if this is a little bit girly but i'm a girl living in a van it's got to be pretty i think that's it i think that's all i wanted to show you if i've forgotten anything i'll just show you in another video but yeah so a bit of a rejig of storage shoe boxes down the front food box food larder things now in the front um outdoorsy things are now at the back of the van underneath the bed I've got a cleaning box, I've put up some decorations and, you know, I'm just slowly adapting to living in here and, um, yeah, the shoebox just makes it tidier, it's nice and it's really pretty and I couldn't resist when I saw it. But yeah, so this is, this is Kevin at the moment, he might look different in a month's time, who knows? <laughs> anyway, I will catch you guys in another video, bye!